I know this as a player, I grew to really dislike coaches who coached one way one week and one week and one way the next, the next week based on what they perceived to be a bigger game than another game. So what we try to do is just really stay focused on uh, being consistent. In what areas? You know, our approach to teaching and the, what we demand and what we expect and how we deal with the players. I, would like. I never liked when a coach made one game bigger than another game. They're all big, you know, and you only get hopefully 13 chances to compete a year. And so um, I learned that a lot of places. But that's one thing that I didn't like as a player, and I always remember that. How, how has the focus been this week with your players, knowing what kind of challenge you guys face Saturday? You know, it was interesting to me. They're like kids. They're like your kids. Uh, they will kind of conform and behave the way you steer them to or train them to. And so it's just been the same stuff. Make a, take a proper angle, make a tackle, you know, throw it to the right guy, block a guy. So the focus has really been on us getting better, which is what we need to do. But, I mean, it's – it's anyone's dream to play in a big house, you know, play in a stadium like that, uh, you know, with the environment, with all the people. So uh, it's going to be an exciting time for us, but, you know, it, it is what it is. I mean, it's still 11 and 11, so, you know, you don't get too caught up in it, but it, it's, it'll be exciting. Is it tough to not look – I mean, just the place is so big. Is it tough not to at least get, catch yourself looking a little bit? I mean, you might catch yourself maybe, but, like, I've, I've been there before. Um, you know, we're going to walk through there tomorrow. Um, you know, so guys are going to be able to get up and look around and see things. And on game day, I mean, you just got to be focused on your assignment, focus on what you got to do. And, uh, you know, you can't really think about all that stuff. Like I said, it's just 11 on 11 out there. You're going against another team. So. I've done it. I've, you know, I've done it countless of times. I don't know how many times I've done it. But it's one of those things that's engraved, ingrained into my, my system. So for me to be on a visitor's side, I'm coaching, you know. I'm an Eastern, I'm an Eastern Michigan Eagle now. Uh, like I said, that, that part of me is still there. That will never, ever be taken away. I tell people, I said, you know, everybody asks me, I said, you know what? I played at Dear One Heights Robichaud, so my heart pumps red, black, and white. I bleed maize and blue, but I cry tears of victory green and white. So no matter how you strike it up, that's a part of me. That's, in, that's, you know, weaved into the fabric of who I am. But so is Eastern Michigan.